Servant Shiresh is always commuting. I wake up at like 4.30, so then I have an hour to get ready, so then I leave home at 5.30, so I can get to the train station by 6. With many legs on his journey to class at San Jose State University are strategically planned. And commuting to school for this electrical engineering junior means taking a car, train, and electric scooter more than five hours every day. Oh, so then uh, I'm actually from Tracy. So I'm technically commuting from home. The problem, limited university space. One of the things in the market that we're seeing that we're lacking is really upperclassmen or transfer um, availabilities. University State Chief Financial Office. Officer Charlie Foss says plans for Campus Village 3 are already in the works. I want to have more housing in general for our students. All right. Foss says CV3 will be built right here once they tear down Washbourne Hall. It'll include new dining commons, more indoor and outdoor spaces for studying, and of course, more dorms. According to University Housing, Suresh was one of about 600 students on the wait list for on-campus housing this year. He was turned down in late July, about a month before the fall semester started. So then, you know, most places that rent are like, we need a month in advance. And then if that's the case, I had to find a place like immediately. And all of them are giving me like these outrageous quotes. Suresh says the commute is worth it. I feel like it's a little bit crazy, but I feel like for me, it's the fact that, hey, I'm so far in right now. I'm already two years in. And I love the program, I love the school. Engineering Dean Cheryl Ehrman agrees that getting an SJSU engineering degree in the heart of Silicon Valley is invaluable. You know, hopefully uh, in that student's case, he's going to end up doing really well afterwards with uh, his degree. So, you know, I hope that there's a great return on his time investment. And hopefully with Campus Village 3 on the way, students like Suresh won't have to make such a big commitment. On campus, Lindsay Boyd, Update News.